Hey, how's it going guys? Pyrodex here and welcome to episode 14 of Sending the T90s. Uh, we got a bunch of racks, hopefully we can break out of our dry streak. Uh, some other PVM and clues. Hope you enjoy. <laughs> this was kind of funny. Um, I got, right as I got the kill, this Earth Battle Staff showed up and then I right clicked and there's two. And one of them was from somebody before and one of them was one that I just got. So that's kind of interesting. Let's put this wealth back on and open this bad boy up. And <clears throat> more purple sweets. Yep, road to 99 construction right there. Got ourselves another Beastmaster kill. We only had like t two T90s, uh, so that was pretty good. So let's see what we get here. And we got a burial charm and some use play bodies. That's a, that's pretty good. Um, still no codex, but some pretty decent loot, I must say. Here's the end of my Reaper Summon, 18 points, that's pretty good. Uh, let's see, we got 170 magic logs. I banked because we went to raids, which you saw earlier. And uh, I think we got like dragon bones, rune bars, and coins or something. So 18 points, that puts us up to... Oops, there's another one spawning. That puts us up to 236, we are getting close. Not the alchemy. Couch port to safety. Oh, wait. Selves our next hard casket. I just looted a dragon longsword from that uh, dragon imp that I just passed by. So let's see. Rub that ring for good luck. I'm feeling something good from this. We haven't got something good in a long time. And of course, another Serdome Plate Skirt. I just got that one like last video, I think. So that's my third now. 190 hard clue scrolls. Reaper assignment, what did we get? Grammy Dwarf Weed. Uh, we also got 15 Runite, some Dwarf Weeds, oh, other Dwarf Weeds, Raw Sharks, and Crystal Keys. How many Reaper points are we up to now? Reaper, I have 254, we're about a few days, we'll have it by the end of the week. We have 1877 Onyx Bolt uh, E, so let's see what that is actually. Uh, that is 16.8 mil in Onyx Bolts. Um, so I'm gonna go get started on elking a few of these. Uh, it's gonna take a while, but uh, I just keep, every time I need to buy something, I come back and elk a few more. So, so I may as well do a bigger chunk now and then uh, get it out of the way. Of our next elite casket. Uh, if this is anything like recently, this is gonna give me um, probably some biscuits and uh, that's about it. So <laughs> let's see, might have a reroll. Let's see what's inside here. <laughs> Uh, yep. The, um, the curse continues. Next one, we get a reroll. Wow. Okay, guys, so now that the, uh, Sun Spear is out, it is a T78 Spear. Um, so I was kind of saving these points for a Chaotic Spear, uh, to do Corp with. Um, so I can kind of get rid of these points now. Um, since I don't really need to buy that one. And I have the Lance as well, which is my, uh, new best uh, melee weapon. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy this Ring of Vigor. This is something that I've wanted for quite a while. Uh, it's going to give me an extra 10% uh, adrenaline there, and there we go. There was our Ring of Vigor. Going to give me an extra 10% adrenaline uh, every time I use an ultimate ability, so that's going to be great at a Raxor. Um, should speed up my kills by quite a bit. I just got a 4 Raxi Reaper assignment, so here is number 1. Let's see what we get. A 2 Onyx, that is... that moves me back up to 20. This is my 22nd. Let's kill two more to go for the Reaper task. I'm going to call some battle staves here. Ah, magic seeds. We can always use that for any XP, I suppose. Killing the Reaper. Let's see what this one is. <laughs> two more Cyrenic scale. Five Reaper points from that. Okay, let's see what we're going to get from that loot. And 400k cash. Haven't got that in a while. So now, actually, let's check. Reaper... 279, that's uh, going to be about two more. So, finally finished Beneath Cursed Tides. That was kind of a cool quest. Uh, so now we can finally loot the uh, Oyster um, once per month. I should have done it like a few days ago, so I could have done it twice. But uh, let's see, these lamps. 
Um, I guess I will put this into... Uh, let's go with prayer, because that's probably the most expensive. Fishing and cooking. This is actually pretty good XP. We got, uh, like... No, surely we didn't get 91k just now. Did we? And 34k... I'm confused. We could have possibly just gotten... Oh, plus the XP from the quest. But still, that's a lot of fishing XP. So let's rub the ring for good luck and see what we get from this oyster. Uh, feed that, feed that. Okay. Oh my. 21 points away from uh, my next Hydrix. So let's see what next assignment. Rots. I kind of need a group for that. So let's skip that. Please be Rax or something I can solo. Yes. Oh, Grid Ore. That's not very many, very many points, but I guess we'll do that. We get those 11 kills, I believe. This will give me 18 points, so I'll be one task away. It is half an hour till reset, so we are good with that. And then maybe I'll do that on stream. Uh, we shall see, but I also got a hard clue scroll during kill count and a halberd which beamed. Uh, so let's see if we can get any luck in here. <laughs> Literally, first kill. And we had Banos Gloves. Oh, I had my private off because I was just doing Garajo as well. That's kind of funny though. I actually needed a placeholder, so that's, uh, I will take that. Bando's Gloves. Final kill of Kuriara here. That's what we got for our last task. And what's the drop going to be actually? Runite Bolts. Wait, what? Hey, there we go, guys. We just discovered the Pincers region for Stainless Steel. Uh, we're now way over here. So, let's head to the ports and uh, start trying our new uh, region uh, messages. Messages? I'm liking this region already. 25 ancient bones for his uh, story progress. That is sick. 89% as well. Let's send that. That's going to be awesome. Time has finally come, we finally have 300 points, so let's go ahead and buy that incomplete Hydrix with Reaper points. Beauty, there we go. So, let's go over to Berthorp and craft this bad boy up. Okay, then we'll go ahead and craft the Unka Onyx into a Hydrix. And now we'll make the bolt tips. <laughs> uh, well, there we go, Hydrix ring we can also make. Death Touch, Bracelet, or Reaper. But we will go ahead and get this Hydrix Ring. So, there we go, look at that. Look at that Hydrix Ring, and let's put this on. Go ahead and hit it with an Enchant. Boom, Ring of Death, plus 25 in all bonus, in all stats, holy. This is gonna be a great ring. That is so nice. Uh, no, let's put my... Ooh, look at that. Check charges. Nice. So that's going to save me from a lot of uh, death. Um, item reclaims, and I have 19 more Onyx in the bank. That's about all that I've got for this week. Thanks a lot for watching, and if you did enjoy, feel free to hit that like button. I would definitely appreciate it. Uh, but hopefully I can get some Rax luck here uh, soon. I'm really hoping to uh, get my T90 soon so I can branch off into some other things. Um, possibly, I'm thinking next series is going to be um, possibly Road to Max with um, hopefully a better title than that. Uh, that's such a cliche title, but uh, hopefully something like that. But it won't just be all skilling. I'm going to be doing uh, a lot of separate other little fun things that I have in mind to do with, to do with clues and otherwise. So it won't just be straight skilling because that would be... 
Um, so I have 168 kills at Raxi. <laughs> Hopefully by like, I don't know, like 250 we have a full Nox. Like I'm hoping. Um, that would be ideal, so hopefully this series doesn't go on, doesn't drag on for too much longer, but uh, thanks for watching this episode, and I will see you next week.